everyone I'm going to do um, kind of a rocker chick look for you guys today and um, it has a really smoked out blue eyes with lots of sparkle and um, kind of um, peachy pink cheeks and then fairly nude pink lips um, the eyes are really really intense and blue and um, I did add some glitter to it too so this is definitely a look you could wear out um, for a night on the town um, all of the products that I'm going to use you can find on my website beautybyviolet.com and if you want to see how I did this really fun rocker chick look just keep watching I'm going to start out by just applying an eye primer and I'm going to apply it from the lash line all the way up to the brow and then also underneath the lower lash line so I'm going to start out with just a flat, sh stiff shader brush, and then um, I'm going to use a Makeup Forever color, and it's this one right here, and it's a dark, really dark, shimmery blue color. And I'm just going to start to apply that to the lid, and I'm just pressing the brush to my lid so that none of the color falls out and then bring it up into the crease and we're going to bring it just a little bit higher than the crease we're also just going to put some of that color on the tip of our brush and run it along the lower lash line going all the way in so next just pick up any big fluffy dome brush and we're going to start blending that out. And you're just going to use windshield wiper motions just working to blend out that top line. Now using the same flat stiff shader brush, I'm going to go in with this really, really bright sparkly blue. And I'm just going to apply that to the lid. Just going up to the crease. And I will put the um, the number to these Makeup Forever col colors on my blog, but since they're um, numbered and they're in the palette, I can't really look at them right now, but I will make sure to put them on my blog. Okay, and switching to a pencil brush, I'm going to apply some of that really bright blue underneath the lower lash line again. Now using another flat stiff shader brush, I'm going to go in with the color Carbon from MAC and I'm going to apply that to the outer corner of the eye. And then just bring it up just a little above the crease and in just a little bit. And take your pencil brush and just put some of that carbon color just on the outer third of the eye. And switching back to your big fluffy dome brush, we're just going to blend that out once again. And blending in this look is key. Just take your time, even if you have to sit and work at it, you know, for a minute or two. Just keep going back and forth over those colors. Next I'm going to go in with a Makeup Forever color that is just close to my skin tone and I'm just going to use a big fluffy brush for this, just a big fluffy shader brush and I'm just going to place that underneath the brow. Okay, So next I'm just going to use a glitter glue 
and I'm just using the Too Faced Shadow Insurance Glitter Glue and I'm just going to put it just on a little brush and then I'm just going to pat that on the inner part of the lid, just the center part of it. And then I'm going to use a, um, a glitter from MAC, it's uh, Reflex Purple and I'm just going to apply that over that glitter glue and it's going to give us a nice sparkle. Your brush is going to pick up a little bit of that glue too. So then you can just take a little bit of that glitter and put it underneath the lower lash line just on the inner third. Okay, now you are going to get a little bit of fallout from that glitter, um, but don't worry about that. You can just take a makeup remover wipe later and wipe it off, and we haven't done our foundation yet, so I'm just going to use the MAC Black Track Fluid Line. And I'm just going to line the upper lash line. And I'm starting from the middle and working outward and then from the middle and working inward. I'm just going to take some of that uh, fluid line and I'm going to put it in the water line on the bottom. I'm going to also put some in the top water line. And then I'm just going to rub some of the fluid line just in the, really close to the lash line. Just right in the lashes, just smudge it right in the lashes. So then you just want to curl your lashes. And then apply mascara and I'm just using the Makeup Forever Aqua Smoky Lash. Okay, so I've just ap uh, applied a pair of lashes to make the look more dramatic, and I just applied um, for my foundation, I applied the Matte Velvet Foundation from Makeup Forever, and then I'm just going to also apply uh, some concealer underneath the eyes, and I'm just using the Bobbi Brown um, uh, Tinted Eye Brightener. I'm just going to use a concealer brush to brush that in. For a powder, I'm going to use the NARS Loose Powder, and this is in the shade Desert. I'm just going to apply a light layer of that just to set the foundation, just in the areas that I need it. Okay, and you can kind of notice by um, putting on that eye brightener and then pulling it downward, it's already given me just a little bit of a highlight. I'm just going to fill in my brows and I'm just going to use the color Espresso from MAC to do that. For a bronzer, I'm just going to use um, Refined Golden from MAC, and I'm just going to apply it right underneath my cheekbones, and then also to my temple and around my hairline. And then underneath my jawbone. For a blush, I'm going to use the color Melba from MAC. And then just my NARS Kabuki brush. And I'm just going to apply that to the apples on my cheeks and then brush it back up into the hairline. 
For a highlighter, I'm going to use one of my favorites. It's a Skin Finish from MAC, and this is in pink porcelain. And then I'm just going to use a dual fiber brush, and then just apply that to the tops of the cheekbones and brush it back. For the lips, I'm going to start out with um, a lip pencil from MAC. This is Subculture. I'm just going to fill them in with that. For a lipstick, I'm going to use Bobbi Brown's Lip Color in Pale Pink. And this is just a really pink, nudie color. And I really, really love this one. I always keep this one in my purse now. And then I'm going to go over that with a gloss from Bobbi Brown, and this is um, Pink Gold. And this is, I believe this is from their Brightening Nudes collection. I'm just going to dab some of that on it. And that's going to just make the lips look fuller. And it does have a bit of shimmer to it, just a little bit. So that completes the look. Really, really daring and rocker chick. It is something that's definitely going to stand out. All the products that I use, I will put on my blog. And I'll put a link to my blog below. And then also, I will make it so that you can click on each product. And then you can see a picture of it. You can see the description and how much it costs on my site. Again, all the products I used, you can find on my website, Beauty by Violet, at a discount. And on my website, there's Bobbi Brown, MAC, NARS. Stila, Laura Mercier, and Makeup Forever at a discount. I am doing a $20 gift card giveaway to my site this week, and to sign up for that, just click the link below. And don't forget to click on the confirmation email, because that's what gets you into the drawing. I will announce the winner to the $20 gift card giveaway on Monday, so be watching for that. It'll be on my Facebook. So, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you really enjoy recreating this look, and I really had a great time making it. See you all soon. Bye-bye.